Hello, lovers of luxury. Today, I'm going to take you inside the most expensive home in Switzerland. It's an absolute beauty. So extravagant, it could almost take even my breath away. Well, almost. It's a lavish winter mansion, which last sold for $185 million, putting it on the list of the top 10 most expensive houses in the world. Plus, it's a personal favorite of mine. So who better to guide you through it? This house is located conveniently in one of my favorite ski resorts, St. Moritz, in the snowy Swiss Alps, where my ultra-wealthy friends and I like to meet up and show off our prowess on the slopes. Skiing at fancy resorts is a pastime associated with wealth and luxury, so there is no better location for an opulent mansion than this. The facade of this estate, while elegant, is actually quite simple, just stone and glass. Although I must say, I quite love like that combination. It almost feels like it's intentionally hiding the luxury inside. That secretive quality means it has an even greater impact as you step through the door. And the first thing you notice when stepping through the door is the huge, six-sided floating staircase at the center of the house. It has no visible support beams, of course, because if you can't defy the laws of physics with your money, you haven't got enough. The reception area is clad in fur, which which you'll notice is an appropriately wintry theme throughout this house. There's actually a wall in this reception area covered in mink. The fur and fires add that feeling of warmth to the room, which is much needed as it looks out onto the snow-covered mountains through towering 35-foot floor-to-ceiling windows. If you know your way around this room, then you'll be able to find the wall that slides away to reveal a hidden library wrapped in a crimson velvet, which gives it a grandiose grace that every library should have. A secret switch reveals yet another hidden room, which, in this case, is a very sleek office with another fireplace. A truly fashionable feature is the sunny breakfast nook. It is, of course, shaped like an egg and continues that theme with the 145,000 egg sculpture hanging from the ceiling. The walls of the room are coated in 24 karat gold. A golden egg, indeed. There are five opulent bedrooms, all with cashmere-covered walls. They're accessible via a sparkling glass staircase, and each of course, as its own adjoining bathroom. One of my personal favorite touches in the whole house is that each bathroom highlights a different rare stone. For example, this bathroom is made entirely of zebra-striped marble, but the master bedroom is by far the grandest of all, as it should be. Its bathroom is coated in dramatic onyx and has a 360-degree shower at its center. The walk-in closet is adorned in 24-karat gold to cleverly turn a functional space into one fit for a king. The room itself has its own fireplace. The floor is draped with white Scandinavian fox fur. And to top it all off, the windows look out onto a $1.8 million sculpture. So the luxury even extends outside the room. As any good mansion should, it features subterranean floors that house rooms of many secrets. Nestled under the master suite is, you guessed it, a wine cellar. Really, you can't call your estate a mansion without a wine cellar. As well as a cinema that's worth $1.3 million. But the grandest feature is the one that makes the best use of this home's surroundings. A ski-in, ski-out access point to the owner's private chairlift onto the slopes. There's also a spa level, which is just the thing that's needed after a day out in the snow. This level of the house boasts a Himalayan salt chamber, which is not only good for relaxing, but also apparently has all kinds of health benefits and is worth having just because it's so in vogue. Plus, there's that all-important steam room and a high-tech shower, which can be programmed to an unimaginable number of different settings and colors, which is probably a little excessive, but there's nothing wrong with that. If you go even lower down in this huge house, you come to a feature that even I was impressed by, an underground lake. It's one of the 
classiest spaces in this already very high-class mansion. The lake itself is illuminated with dazzling Swarovski crystal lights. The ceiling reflects Venetian artwork, and as the cherry on top, the walls are a mirrored Italian art installation. It's a perfectly extravagant final touch to a grand estate. Really, this mansion has it all. The furs, the some might say ridiculous numbers of fireplaces, the references to classical architecture, perfect lighting, the high-priced artwork, the staircase that defies gravity, floor-to-ceiling windows, plenty of extravagances that would encourage any normal person to never leave the house. And the occasional over-the-top use of actual 24-karat gold? Well, what more could a wealthy person possibly ask for? Perhaps I better put in an offer myself. Well, if you had an underground lake, what's the first thing you would do? If it were me, I'd probably whip out one of my jet skis. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And as always, I'm Mr. Luxury, pip pip to doodly do.